don't even know what to say right now. I'm just kind of in my feelings. And I felt like I should record it because I don't really have anything else to do other than, sorry, I'm looking at myself. It's terrible vlogging material, but I'm just, I woke up like two hours ago. Um, it's like two or some, two something, I think. And I was just kind of walking around my house thinking about things. Um, I don't know, getting emotional <laughs> over being in the house and like what I have to do. Um, I was like walking through my old room and like, I don't, I don't know what to say. I don't know how to express myself, <laughs> kind of, I guess. I just, I'm moving out of this place. Um, this is my old room here. Um, and it's bittersweet almost. Um, because we moved here like I th about three years ago, what, like 2017? Um, yeah, 2017, spent 2018 out here, began 2019 out here, you know, it's fucking about to be March, you know, and, um, oh, my arm is getting tired. Um, sorry. Um, And when we first moved out here, me and my family, like, it was exciting. Like, I'd never been to Texas before, you know? It was just super exciting to be somewhere different and to actually have a house, you know? And, you know, to switch um, states and to switch stores when I was working at Chuck E. Cheese. Um, no, that conspiracy is fuck so fucking fake, by the way. Um, that was a reach. Um, I don't know. And like being here for about three years and then now having to leave is shitty in one way, but good in the other <laughs> because I've had so many issues in this house. It's just so many issues, so much shit has happened in this house, and it's definitely time that I fucking leave. <laughs> like, I need to, I can't afford to be here. I can't afford to live here by myself. Um, I could barely afford it when I have roommates, you know, and I just, it sucks that I, I've been in this house by myself for about a month now. It's so my last roommate's just fucking up and left. Um, which I filmed a video on that, um, but I think I might redo it because it was just, I was very in my feelings and didn't really articulate everything that happened very well, um, but I digress. Um, I don't, I don't even know where I'm going with this. I'm just, I'm filming this because I feel like I want to make more content. I'm not really like, I'm not a YouTuber by any fucking means. Like <laughs> I haven't made a video in months. Um, and I, I feel like I should do something like this, even if it's just kind of vlogging and like, you know, f you know, making a video when I'm like emotional or like when I want to talk to myself about something or talk to someone about something, but I'd, I'd rather make a video about it, you know? I'd rather film myself like this. Even if no one watches, just to kind of document how I feel. Um, yeah. I don't really know what else to say. Um, it's shitty. It's shitty that I'm having to, that I'm having to leave, you know? It's shitty that 
I'm having to leave this place behind and go and start, start living with somebody else again. I was so happy living by myself. Um, mentally, I was just, I was, I'm doing pretty well, like living by myself. <laughs> Financially, I cannot afford it, like at all. Like that's just not something that is possible for me at this time, but fucking everything else, I was, I was so content. I've been so content just being by myself and not having anyone else, else in the house. Um, and it kind of sucks that I have to, you know, I'm moving in with my friend for a little bit and then I'm moving back out to California and I'm moving in with two other people. So, and that's not what makes me sad because I'm going to be living with friends, you know, it's just the fact that I have to live with other people again. That... I don't, I don't know how to articulate that well. I hope you guys understand what I'm, what I'm trying to say. Like I've, I've been doing so well being by myself mentally and not feeling like I'm taking from other people or like I'm taking advantage of someone else um, because it's just been me by myself paying my bills every week and all of that. You know what I mean? That like now I have to go and live with someone else and I obviously I'm, I have to help them with rent and all of that stuff and um but it's for something good like i'm trying to um fix my life essentially like i'm trying to go back to school you know i'm trying to get my esthetician's license i've been trying to do that for the past like three four years um and i just couldn't fucking do it financially you know um I'm trying to like fix my credit, <laughs> uh, pay shit back that I owe to companies and shit. You know, like I am in so much debt. It's fucking crazy. I am going to be 23 this year and my credit is severely fucked and I'm just in so much debt and I have a, you know, a student loan that I have too. And it's just fucking wild that... <laughs> I just don't make enough money, you know, and I've just been so fucking stubborn with trying to find a new job and trying to get a second job and it, that shit just not fucking working out, you know, and just always struggling. Like, I'm so ready, so ready to fucking kind of get a restart on my life. Like, California is going gonna, is gonna to be my journey on fixing my life essentially like I am gonna fix all of those things I'm going to I'm going back to school like that is my number one thing for sure is going back to school then obviously I'm gonna be working as well but going back to school I'm gonna get my fucking license and I'm gonna start that career and I'm gonna become an esthetician. Like I wanna be able to do facials and waxing and doing people's makeup, like definitely doing people's makeup. Like um, I've actually been thinking about maybe getting into massage therapy, but I don't know a whole lot about that. But I feel like that would be a good addition to being an esthetician because sometimes during facials, like if they're wearing a mask and stuff like that, um, you kind of massage their arms and stuff like that too and their hands, kind of get them relaxed and everything. And I feel like getting into massage therapy and kind of getting a license or a certificate or whatever for that too would be ideal as well. Cause then I would be a fucking like a quadruple threat. Um, but yeah, I'm just, be I don't know, being in this house, I'm leaving the good lighting right now. Being in this house and leaving it is kind of bittersweet moment. Let's see, I've got just boxes and things packed up. I have things that I need to return to companies. Like I have to cancel utility bills and whatnot and all of that stuff. <laughs> um, I'm having a rent dilemma. Um, <laughs> I'm leaving before March. I thought I was going to need March to, you know, find a place and move out and like get a ticket and all that shit, but I don't anymore. And I told them that I didn't need March anymore. And they're like, okay, well, you're still, you're still responsible for paying March's rent. I'm like, oh, great. Fantastic. So now I'm having to pay 
for a month that I don't need, which is fucking always great, right? So, yeah, I don't, <laughs> I'm struggling big time and I'm ready to fucking not struggle anymore. I'm ready to fucking get my life back together and get this show on the road, you know? Yeah. Yeah. All right. I don't really know what else to say right now. So I just thought I'd film that. I may come back. I may not. We'll see. But I just kind of wanted to film what I was feeling at the time. Kind of even if no one is watching, just kind of talk to myself about these kinds of things because I'm always, I'm always bitching to other people about my problems and I'm kind of getting to the point where I just, I need, I feel like I need to stay silent about everything because I just, I push so much of my problems onto other people and it's not even like I'm wanting them to fix it. It's just, I need someone to listen and <laughs> I feel like shit because, you know, I get it, that's what friends are for, but at the same time, it's, I just do it way too often and I feel bad and I just need to stop. So, I'm kinda, I'm kinda gonna start using this as therapy. You know, just kinda when I wanna talk to someone or whatever, but, I don't really want to talk to actual people, you know, or like friends because I'm always telling them about everything like this. So I think I'd rather just vlog or film it or whatever and just kind of talk myself through shit. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Again, I may... <laughs> there might be more to this. There might not be. We'll see at the end of the day. Um, yeah. I may vlog moving out tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how things go. Um, but, yeah. I think I'm going to try and start doing something like this. Again, I'm not... <laughs> I'm not considering myself to be, like, any sort of, like, full-time youtuber or vlogger or anything like that like i've never made money off of any of my videos even though they're all monetized like i just i'm a small channel and i'm just kind of doing what i want with it so but yeah i think i might start doing something like this at least for a little bit just to kind of document what i'm going through you know Okay, I've talked to my camera long enough. I've like said bye like twice already. So I'm going to say bye again. <clears throat> um, and hope that there is more to this. If I have more thoughts and everything like that, I will film such. But yeah. <laughs> okay, bye. Hello, cruel world. Look how I went. <laughs> Almost crashed his computer part. <laughs> Look at all of my shit in the back. Isn't it wonderful? It's moving day and it's fucking freezing out. And we're going to the Dollar General because I need packing tape. <laughs> because of course I would run out of something that I fucking need. Oh, what an asshole. <laughs> Just trying to make something in your life, like, you know. Entertaining. entertaining. Yeah. <laughs> Cause it's not. Because it's not. It's not. <laughs> okay, we're going inside the store and I'm not gonna film in the store, so. Bye. Mission accomplished. I got more packing tape and a goddamn screwdriver because I just never have tools at my house, apparently. Just always, always fun. Oh, by the way, I texted my mom and <laughs> Uh, Not yet. Wrong turn. Oh, they close. 
Already? Yeah. I guess they closed that one. That's rude. That is rude. How dare they? Honestly. How dare they? Donut shop over there. You guys don't deserve donuts. Apparently. <laughs> um, but I texted my mom mm -hmm. about Kiana and told her that to have fucking Kiana call me. Mm -hmm. She wanted all the plates and stuff because I'm going to be out of the house within the next three hours. So. Yeah. Otherwise, they're just going to be donated. So, hopefully she gets back to me or hopefully, like, Kiana calls me or whatever because... Correct. <laughs> Otherwise, she's not getting them! Isn't this just so fun? Filming is just so fun. My life is boring. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm just doing it. Okay, we're back home now. Uh, what are we going to get next? Um, I guess whatever else you pack. Okay. But we have to get those screws first. Trust me. I'll just leave this in here. I don't know why. Let's get the screwdriver. For half a second, I was like, where's my phone? It's in my goddamn hand. And I didn't lock the door. Because fuck locking the door, right? I don't have anything worth stealing. Okay, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna do some screws now. Okay, bye. Can you not? We get full view of my double chin with that angle. Listen, you're fine. He's fine, right? Oh, there's just a gathering out there. A gobble of white people. A gobble? A gobble of white people. <laughs> Not a gaggle, but a gobble. Oh, a gaggle. That gaggle. Gaggle of yes. like, turkey. Gaggle or? of geese. Gaggle of geese, yes. Yes. Gaggle of white people. Also, gaggle of gays. Ah. Yes. Then they need a different name. <laughs> the white people? Yes. Yes. A gathering of the white people. Gather I mean, I would say KKK, but you know. <gasps> No! Let's not do that. Let's not, let's not do that. We love white, white supremacy in 2019. Mm, I don't know about that. I don't know about that, he says to the mixed boy in his car. It's good and fresh. Uh, <laughs> listen here, sister. 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 Sister spook. Sh <laughs> listen, <laughs> flashback Mary. We don't need another one of those. No thanks. I mean, isn't that what you usually look like? Bitch! Excuse you! That is not! Teeth. Fuck. At least I don't have a shit ton of chest hair on me when I have drag makeup on. Ma'am. It's, <laughs> it's not like it's a common occurrence. Are you sure? Yeah. There's multiple queens that have chest hair and beard. I don't! I don't know how I feel about that, to be honest. Yeah. I mean, bearded queens are cute if they, if they make it cute, you know what I mean? If they know how to work and incorporate that but still look fish for their look. But like, chest hair is on a whole nother level for me. Women have chest hair too? I mean, most of it is like paint fuzz though. <laughs> Unless they have like really high testosterone levels. Or whenever they get pregnant. That's true too. They grow more hair. Because their hormones go like mm -hmm. fucking haywire. We love, we love copyright music. Mmm. Well, listen. It's fine. I will just put my own music over it. That's not. Try and drown it out. It's fine. It's not how editing works. It's fine. It'll it's just sound like a clusterfuck. Fine. <laughs> you know what? I'm not expecting to get any money from these fucking videos anyway, because I don't get paid from any of mine before. So it's fine. If I get hit with a fucking copyright strike, copyright strike or whatever, y'all bitches can have that money. Because I'm not doing this for money. YouTube is just a failed thing as a job anyway. You can relate. I, I can, honestly, truly can relate. 
There's a reason I'm moving out of this house and I'm a broke bitch. Who else can relate? Leave a comment down below. No. Don't do that. Don't listen to him. This is my channel. Also, don't honest. subscribe or hit the bell icon. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> no one asked you for anything. Oh, rude ass. But we're on our way to the house now. So fun. This is so fun and fresh and exciting. Oh, look at that. Those trees were really pretty. Did I tell you that I'm gonna need your address? Yes. Yeah. Obviously, I wouldn't say it while you're recording. <laughs> Obviously. Well, you're gonna have to, you're probably gonna, no, never mind. I'll just put it in my notes and just save it or something. Cause I'm gonna need it for when I Uber home and shit too. Also, how is that going to work? Do you have a spare key or? Okay. Because I don't want to like arrive home and be like, hey, you're you locked out. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> how am I going to get inside? You don't. <laughs> I'm just locked out. Outside. For just hours on fucking end. Correct. Having to be like, Hello? Help. Help. I'm cold. It's still winter. Where's my bag? Oh, there it is. So if you don't lose that, we're fine. I won't lose it. I'll just keep it in my wallet. Immediately like lose all of my, <laughs> Like all of my other keys. I mean, listen, it would be the first time that that has happened to me. I mean, that's probably what happened to the other key. Which one? For your old house. For this one? I have both keys. They're, They're both in my wallet. Right? Yeah. But she came down last time. I was like, so do you have the other key? She was like, oh yeah. I have to turn those in. Yeah. So I was like, I kind of need those to turn in, so. Tell your dog I said hi. We don't have a dog. I wish. But I can't have pets. But I'm getting a hamster. You're getting a hamster? Mm -hmm. When? I don't know. Whenever I have money for a hamster. <laughs> Why a hamster? I don't know. I love hamsters. They're cute. Have you had one before? Yes. I used to have one. But else. they didn't live very long because really? yeah. I didn't know how to take care of one. Didn't realize they needed, you know, 40 gallon tanks <laughs> or like giant cages. Mm -hmm. Well, I love a good animal murderer. <laughs> PETA, I'm calling upon you. No, don't call PETA, they'll do nothing. I mean, I can relate. Honestly. Can't everybody? Well, maybe not. There are people that are very positive in life and can't relate. Nope. Sure can't. Sure can't. Mm. Such riveting content. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> I'm just doing this just to do it. It's fine, it's fine. We've arrived at the new home for like a month. Hopefully. Yeah, that's mm. crazy. Hello. I'm in the new place. Well, temporary place at least. It's cute, it's quaint. I'm not gonna be here for very long, but you know, my friend is out there watching a video real quick before we go back to the house and grab the rest of my shit. Um, we just put like all of like the groceries and stuff away. So we're gonna go back and like get my TV and all of that and hopefully um, give my like plates and stuff like that to a friend but um yeah this is just an update on where i'm at on today um it is currently three in the afternoon and we're almost done so far i also have an early morning shift for work 
so that's gonna be fucking fun. Um, but yeah, this is just kind of an update on where I'm at right now. And we'll check back in soon. It's like I'm doing a wear test or something. I'm not. I'm just filming my life and moving out. Okay, bye. All right. We're saying bye to the house. We're saying bye bye to the house. It's all like cleaned out and stuff now. And we're just gonna collect the rest of our stuff. Get the fuck up on out of here. <laughs> now he doesn't wanna be on camera. All right. Bye house. Hello, everybody. So I just um, <clears throat> got settled in to my room. That's just the air mattress going off. Um, just kind of set some stuff up here. Obviously I didn't get too comfortable because I'm not really gonna be here very long. This is just kind of a temporary thing. Um, but got my little makeup station set up here, the little lamp that I had, and like all of my clothes that are just kind of in my bags there. And my TV and my PlayStation and stuff like that set up too. Um, it's almost 12 <laughs> and I have a shift that I have to be at in like, a good old like three hours um but yeah i thought i'd just pop in say hi um this is probably gonna be the end of my little movie vlog here moving vlog here um but yeah i'm gonna take off my makeup here um finish eating probably watch some videos, kind of wind down, and then um, I'm gonna take my ass to bed. So, yeah. Um, if you enjoyed <laughs> any of this, um, go ahead and hit that like button down below if you would like. Um, subscribe to see more content like this or like make it videos or music um, from me. And uh, hit that notification bell if you want to be notified anytime I happen to upload or post something. Um, and yeah, uh, until I see you guys next time, I want you all to stay fabulous. All right, bye.